Jake Shapiro here for Buff Sports Live, recapping the Rocky Mountain Showdown where the Colorado Buffaloes win 17-3. Last year it was 44-7 and the offense really dominated as well as the defense. This year, offense was a little cold at the end of the game, but the defense was stout. The talk about this team coming into the season, well, can the defense stop anybody? Mike McIntyre even joked about it after the game. They thought we couldn't tackle anybody. They tackled a lot of dudes today. Here's Mike McIntyre post game. And, um, that was a heck of a job. Um, I don't think anybody think we were supposed to be able to tackle anybody from everything that I heard. Um, and uh, so I didn't even know we could even put anybody out there. But those kids really played hard. I was really proud of them. The star of the game had to have been CU's corner Isaiah Oliver, who absolutely covered up Michael Gallup, who's one of the best wide receivers in the country, bar none. Remember Hollywood Higgins at CSU? This guy might be better than Rashad. You look at Isaiah Oliver's game, unbelievable. You look across from him, Trey Udofia, the red shirt freshman, was great. Here's the defensive guys talking about how impressive that defense was, led by first year defensive coordinator DJ Elliott. Yeah, they're very talented, um, and they're going to play hard and keep going. They, you know, they made some mistakes tonight, but they both they all kept battling and battling and battling. Um, and uh, you know, Dante Sparacco had a sack there. He's a true freshman, and um, Collier had a sack. He's a true freshman, and redshirt um, freshman uh, Trey had a pick. You know, um, so they'll keep getting better, but they'll get much improved from this week to next week. You know, Colorado only scored 17 points in this game, all in the first half. But if you look at it. That was way more than enough because the defense was so good. Steven Montez in his first time as the true QB1 was impressive for the first half. Made a great touchdown pass to Shea Fields. Phil Lindsay in this game, over 100 yards, and this is a guy we talk about being a potential Heisman candidate this year. The heart that he plays with, being a Colorado kid here on this field, uh, it, it came through today, and it really is what led the Colorado offense was Phil Lindsay. It's always about Phil Lindsay, and you got to toss it to Phil talking about his own game. It's, it's a pretty good feeling. Uh, you know, to go out my last year, you know, be, uh, last year I would never play at the Colorado Rocky Mountain Showdown. Colorado CSU right now, so it feels pretty good to be able to get, get, uh, get the win from myself. Overall, the Colorado Buffaloes are now 1-0 to start their season. They end their two-game skid at the end of last season. Of course, the Pac-12 championship game and the Alamo Bowl. You've got a good taste in your mouth as Colorado's got two cupcakes in front of them. For Buff Sports Live, I'm Jake Shapiro.